everybody, this is uh, Jim Wallace, alias Mr. Graphic, doing another vlog from Indianapolis, Indiana. Uh, on my last vlog, I was telling you that uh, we were expecting our first big snow of the season. And uh, I thought it would be maybe four inches. Well, it, we actually had about seven inches. and uh, But it was, a, it was a nice fluffy snow. You could blow it and it would kind of blow away like little bubbles. No, in other words, it didn't stick, and it wasn't uh, really a problem. Uh, rather rather beautiful if you want to look at it from a photographic standpoint. And I did get out and take some photographs. So, uh, But that was our first big snow, and until then, uh, which was last weekend, uh, we had only had less than an inch of snow the whole season. So uh, that, was, uh, that was pretty unique, I think. We've had basically fairly warm weather. In the 50s uh, today of course we have snow on the ground and it's about freezing but uh, even at freezing uh, with the Sun out snow melts uh, so uh, it's uh, for you for those of you who probably have not seen snow before uh, it will melt even though it's freezing um, as long as the Sun's out and um, uh, different factors are at play uh, I also wanted to talk today about um, David Letterman. Now, right in the rear, through my rear window, you can see a little building. That was the uh, uh, radio station WNTS, which is where uh, David Letterman basically got his start here in Indianapolis. Uh, it's a uh, small AM station, and they are still on the air but they no longer broadcast from the uh, the little building. The transmitter is there, and they have four antennas up, but uh, the station is now downtown. Uh, in the old days, uh, you would broadcast from uh, uh, from where the transmitter was located. That's that's what that's that's the way it was back when I was in radio. But now they uh, leave the transmitter out in the country someplace, and. Uh, they put the station downtown, and uh, that works out better these days. Uh, David Letterman uh, went to uh, Ball State University here in Indiana, uh, Anderson, Indiana, which is about, uh, I don't know, 75 miles north of here. I'm in Indianapolis, and we're 150 miles south of Chicago. So uh, Anderson is about one-third of the way uh, towards the north east of, uh, of Indianapolis. And today there's a uh, building dedicated uh, to David Letterman called the David Letterman School of Communications or something like that. Uh, anyway, he got his start on uh, college radio. And uh, before that, he attended, uh, he was born here in Indianapolis. He attended Broad Ripple High School which is a, a suburb uh, just north of Indianapolis. And uh, he uh, worked for a local uh, TV station, which today is called WTHR, Channel 13. He was a, a weatherman, weatherman, and he was a very funny weatherman. <laughs> he, uh, he made it so comical that it, they eventually uh, fired him because he was uh, really not taking the job seriously, but he was funny. Uh, but without humor, he went to uh, radio and uh, worked at this station for uh, some time. And this station, by the way, is only two miles from where I live, so it's very uh, close to me. Uh, uh, Betty White, the famous actress, uh, her husband, uh, before he died, uh, had a, uh, a very popular game show on network television. And I can't think of his name or the name of the show, but David Letterman interviewed him at the station here uh, and asked, David asked him, uh, how can I get into um, comedy? So he said, go to uh, Los Angeles and go to the comedy store and, and uh, go that route. So David left, went to Los Angeles, took his wife and family. And uh, after being there for a while, uh, he caught the attention of... Uh, uh, Johnny Carson, who eventually uh, hired him as a writer, and uh, he uh, 
every, everyone thought, including David Letterman, that he would assume the, uh, uh, the job of host on The Tonight Show uh, after um, Johnny Carson uh, left the show, but that didn't happen. Instead, uh, David Letterman went to CBS and his show actually was on the air. David Letterman uh, Late Show uh, was on the air longer than uh, Johnny Carson, I think 25 years or something like that. Anyway, David is retired, and I think he lives in on the East Coast somewhere. But uh, just a little bit of history. Uh, I like to uh, make my little vlogs uh, somewhat educational. <laughs> so... Uh, instead of just, you know, rambling. Um, so anyway, I'll, uh, I'm gonna sign off. I appreciate you um, watching my vlog, watching my channel, which is uh, Jim Wallace, alias Mr. Graphic. So please subscribe and like and hit the bell so you'll be reminded the next time I'm on the air.